here we are, RB Bass Circuit, West Division, Lake Mexico, he called me Indiana. John DuPont and I catching a mess of largemouth off their beds and channels. Only challenge right now is we don't have any good ones. We got plenty of time. We got a limit in about one hour. So tune in, bed fish train. Yeah. See what I'm using? B&M Custom Baits Dream Cycle. On a drop shot. And that is going to keep it a five. How's it going? Yeah. All right, thank you, thank you. That's Heath Wagner, and he's a jerk. John, what are you about to do? Yeah, I didn't hit it. You got it. Don't pee everywhere, you're losing my weight. Drop shot with that B&M Custom Baits. Dream shot. It's gotten most of our fish today. Oh. Do that. Retarded. That's you Step on me. my rod, break it. That's because you made me change the way that I set my hook. What are you talking about? Just lift it up like that. Right back there, you still there. Yep. I don't know. Best fish we got. He ain't the best fish. Best fish you got. <laughs> we are starting to have some fun. That may help us. Nice and thick. Right there. Right where he's supposed to be hooked. There you go. I got him all fired up for you. Yeah, team it. You're welcome. I set, I set the hook and my spool, the, my real spool just opened. Oh. <laughs> John and I are going to put on a bed fishing clinic today. Dream cycle. That's the good weather. So here we are. We got tired of catching those fish in the dang channels because they're all the same size. Come out here and first bed that I had marked from yesterday. Here she is. All right, so John, we're back in the game here. Oh, what a bite. Everything's biting that dream shot by being them custom baits. Now I try to teach you, John. I try to teach you how to catch a fish. It's not my fault you can't do it. I mean, I feel guilty to my family for not charging you at least $300. Tell 
door on the windy side. The beds, the beds we're finding, uh, you, you gotta look. Thankfully, you gotta have these polarized glasses. You can see just kind of a little bit of a darker spot. And and uh, I think we made the right move going out the main lake. We've calling out these large mouth, well, these small mouth now. Got a little me uh, nice little smallmouth here. It means even a blind squirrel can find a nut every now and then. Andy's been putting on a show today. Well, that's because I let him cast. Get in used front to of that, me. don't we? It's a hunter fish, John. Almost, almost took a drink. Deserves a hug. You like the extreme bass tackle too as well, don't they? Formula G3. Been throwing it out here for years though. I think they eat a lot of perch out here. Most people don't realize that. And that mimics that that mimics a perch a little bit. I mean he's that guy, but There it is. Another bed, smallmouth. That's a little B&M cousin baits. Drop shot way to use. Well, we got extreme bass tackle fish. Another one. I don't think he's gonna call. I don't think he's gonna do anything for us, John. No. Definitely made the right move to get out of those channels, John. Yep. Keep calling up. I don't know if we're going to have enough weight to do any damage in the tournament, but that guy like making ourselves a little more competitive. Oh. Hey, John, why do you I start bringing your ranger? Oh. Catches better, better, bigger fish. <laughs> Say, John, uh, give me the fish that. Hey, give me the fish that I caught, but that's pretty much all, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Where's that one at? Out there. <laughs> huh? Out there. I wasn't wanting to go in that big rock pile. Like this. No. You didn't tell me nothing. Alright, big fish. <laughs> Two point seven zero. Uh, I should have asked. Anybody want to confirm our weights? Sure, I'll watch over your shoulder. Okay. How's that? Right. Two hundred and ten. Two hundred and one. If I went there, I'd say two eight. You're like, oh, okay. Hold on, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> Squeeze him. Oh, wait. Oh, I'll have very often. Supposed to confirm it. Eleven. I like the top. Eleven oh one. Eleven oh one. We don't know where the big one is. Somebody, somebody led me astray. Hey, you too, Steve. Nice job. You weighed five fish today. All right, Wagner. We got Brad Jones handy. Get over here, Bradley. Take a picture. Not every day we can see. What? Professor Jones, that's right, Wagner. Come on. Okay. You see, that's why you should have dug a trench. I know. <laughs> My boots are water. We're good. All right, put the big one in here. No, you do. No. Oh, it matters, baby. That matters. Everything matters. Uh -huh. Big fish. Ooh, yeah. Big 2.12. 2.12. Yeah, yeah. Hey. I don't know. You might be close to 11. Oh, 10 8. Total weight. Gosh, 
this thing. I am getting good. 10.72. 10.72. Heath Wagner talks to trash the wrong people. We ended up beating Heath, but we did not win the tournament. We ended up finishing 11th out of 43 teams. Winners are actually John Gibson Jr. and Tom Noe, who weighed 12.87 pounds of smallmouth bass. Caught on the main lake. We had certainly caught a fair share of fish. Large mouth. We spent too much time going after those large mouth. The small mouth definitely seemed to dominate the tournament as far as the top teams go. Okay. 